Hello, in this Bootstrap 4 video we're going to cover background variants and these are classes that allow you to change the color of the background and the border of your card. They're really simple to use. So I'll just show you how to actually use it. All you have to do is go to your div that is the outermost container for your card, the one that has a class of card and add an extra class and we'll show you all of the the different ones so card dash primary the first one so these styles are very similar to what you will have used with buttons and other elements inside bootstrap so if you're familiar with the different styles for bootstrap you'll feel right at home here but like i said we'll show you all the different ones anyway let's go back refresh and there you go the very I mean the background and the border color has changed for our card I think that this black color doesn't look very good so what you can do is just use the built-in bootstrap card dash inverse class which just inverts the color of the text and it just makes it look that little bit better but if you don't want it like that you can omit this and set your own color if you want to so like i said we're going to show you all the different cards so let's just copy and paste this div next one we're going to show you is card dash success the third one is card dash info Fourth one is card dash warning. And the final one is card dash danger. So let's just change that here. Now we're ready to refresh our browser. Refresh, and there you go. We have four, five different cards. And as you can see, the color is different for every single one and like I said they match the styles that you will have used for let's say the button for example because we got a button right here if we just go to one of these buttons we got button dash success and if we go to the success card it has a similar color hence what you can't see so that's the reason you wouldn't want a success button on a success card you generally can't see it or, or you might want to that's your choice but actually we want you to as an extra task just mess around with the different styles for the button and see what you can do. If you have any questions, feel free to post them on our education platform, sonarlearning.co.uk forward slash question.php. There'll be a link in the description to that. Plus, there'll be another link in the description to the source code from this video and all the source code from every single video in this series. Please rate, comment and subscribe. And as usual, thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day.